<laughs> How's it going, guys? Q here. So, a while ago, I decided, decided to do Mega Man, one well, notorious for being one of the hardest platforming games ever. So, I've trained a bit on the NES. I've beat Super Mario Bros. 3, which I might be doing LP on later. And I decided I'm going to go through all the hardest NES games out there. At least what's been said. So, first off, Big Mega Man. I'm going to be playing the entire Mega Man um, game series up to Mega Man 7 on the SNES. So, we got that handled. And 90,000! Jeez, that's over 90,000! That's exactly 90,000, but whatever. So, here we are. We are playing Bomberman stage. I am already screwing up. Wow. Come on, don't touch me. Whoa. Okay, so, basically, I have trained with the other games, and now I believe I'm ready. As far as other platforming games that are really difficult, I'm going to attempt. This is going to be, of course, the first seven games of Mega Man, and along with the Ninja Gaiden trilogy, which is notorious for being definitely one of the hardest games out there. I'm serious. I know, like, several people who completely and utterly failed at it, otherwise just quit, because they couldn't do it. Okay, so, as you can tell, this is definitely not going to be a no-hit run. Um, I might be able to go for a no-death run. I doubt it, though. But, hey, let's go with a shot. No! Okay. I don't want to follow you. That would be very unfortunate. Okay, so let's go grab this health file down here. Boop! And grab this. Okay, so I pretty much learned all the basics of Mega Man. I know everything much better now. I got the basic controls now. I actually have a controller now. Or I was playing with the keyboard, now I have a controller. It's so much easier now. Okay, with these guys, basically what I want to do is just jump, and you can force them to either shoot or jump, and that will just make it them vulnerable to hit. So, stuff. And here are the little, I think, Betty Bills, I think they're called, or something like that. I don't know. The not bullet Bills. And I can't hit by that one guy. What, the same bullet? Too? Wow. That's stupid, but whatever. Okay, I did not mean that. It's much better just to ignore them. If you hit them, they'll explode, and I'll just make it terrible. Okay, for these guys, I found a little a little trick about them. I did not know you can shoot them to make them stop. I did not know that. Another thing you can do is just, if you're on a platform with one, just jump a lot. Just jump as fast as you can. It's seriously the best way to avoid them. So let's go! Holy mackerel, that scared me. Okay, cool. Not worth it. Okay, let's go. And here we are, and oh, these guys. Right. Nobody likes these guys, especially not me. No, you! <laughs> Those spikes, man. Those spikes always mess me up so much with no death run. Okay, I'm gonna go for no continue run, even though I'm gonna fail that too. But, I'm just gonna try to be Mega Man, okay? I, I don't care anymore. No nothing run. Uh, is that the name of the series, the No Nothing Run of Mega Man? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so let's jump. No, back up, bro. Oh, wow. I avoided all that. Oh, pff, oops. If I kept running, I probably would have just fine. Oh wow, what now would do? Wow, this is quite actually pretty impressive. I was not expecting all this evasion to come for me. If this guy to finish what he's doing. And jump down here and go or not. Go past this guy and grab his life. It's definitely one of the easiest lives to attain in the game, so. Um I'm gonna be playing in the order that I think makes the game easiest, also lets you get all the items which makes the game notoriously easier, so. There will be one part where I may have to use a glitch to, well not so much a glitch, but an exploit to beat Iceman, just cause Iceman, as we all know, is just my, not my hero, that's something to say. And, oh man. If you jump up there, you can, yeah, get to respawn like that and then grind lives, but I couldn't do it that time, so, I don't care. Okay, and here we are at the boss level already. Huh. For Bomb Man, which I think, oh, okay, is one of the easier levels. And for me, my hardest level will be Iceman, so I'll probably be the last one I'm gonna do. The rest of them, though, I'm going to do in just the order I think it's best. So, man, grab that, which is bonus points, I found out. Gives you a thousand bonus points for each one of those you collect. It just says, okay, I was not expecting those guys. Okay, I think you just want to hug the right wall on that part, but. Okay, and where is he gonna spawn? Is he gonna spawn top me? Oh, okay, he's gonna spawn next to me. Shoot. Just shoot like crazy, jump past the jump over the past the bombs. It's pretty simple. When he jumps at you, that's probably the hardest move to avoid. Just be okay. Yep. Okay. I was expecting that. Don't worry, I had low health, I was expecting that. So this time I'm gonna show you how to do it properly. To get down here, just hug the right wall without getting hurt. And 
Perfect. That worked out perfect for me. <laughs> My pants look perfect. Okay, so along with this, I'm going to be trying to beat the Super Marvelous 3, which I know I can't beat, and Su the original Super Marvelous, which I've never beaten before. Along with the Ninja Gaiden Trilogy, like I already explained, those are going to be my, I guess, 8-bit platform games for a while. I guess Super Mario was technically 16 bit, but whatever. Whoa, okay. Just shoot like crazy. If you have full health, it's worth, it's worth losing a little bit. Just boop! Okay, so just worth losing a little bit. And now we get the bomb, Bomberman ability, which I did not know that you get different abilities for this. <laughs> our first run. So in this one, now we get 90,000 points for that, which is awesome. But we also get to the bomb gun thing. I can't remember exactly what it's called. It's like bomb thing. I don't know. So we're going for Gutsman next, because he has an ability that will help us get new items in the game. Gutsman is the platforming one that I really did not... 100,000! Good God. That I really was not friends with in my first run of this game. That was a stupid run, I guess. I don't know. Okay, so, let's try. Come on, come on, come on. Crack my knuckles. Get prepared, and jump. And jump back! Okay. If you get past this level part, I remember this level being notoriously easy, actually. Uh, why do I keep saying notoriously? I don't know why. Okay, and there's these guys, which are totally mean. And upset my dietary functions and make me sad. What? I don't know. These are basically the same guys from the... Okay, I made him go off screen, which made him disappear. This is basically the same guy from the other level, the little guys with shields just keep going back and forth and shooting them, they should go away. And it's worth losing a little bit of health. That's another way to get through this game relatively fast, just allow yourself to lose a little bit of health every now and again. Not too much, though. Okay, actually, oh, that was actually very convenient, okay. I was about to say that, um, whoa, okay. I actually think you're supposed to jump down here. Yeah, okay. Can I make it? Can I make it? Oh, yeah! Free health. Nice. Oh, whoa! Okay. Oh, yeah, if, we went, if I go and left a little bit more, I probably could have gotten one up, but whatever. I think I can make it through this. And there's this guy. Just jump over him. Oh, no, that frame rate dropped. No, 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 no. He gets a huge chunk of damage, so just watch out for him. And now we're going next room. And just these guys just keep shooting forward, and then to keep shooting walking forward. You can take care of them relatively easy, actually. And I think I have zero lives left, is that correct? Oh, I have one life. That's awesome. Okay. With one life, I can totally take down this guy. So let's begin. You see those rocks? He's going to attempt to throw those rocks at us later on. It's nothing too big. He'll just throw it at us. And I keep forgetting about that. Um, I just broke the mic there. Sorry. You're right. When he's about to hit the ground, just jump, and... Oh, okay, I missed that one. Oh, no, stop it. Why am I keeping missing that? Stop it! If you mess it up, he's probably gonna hit you with that. Just watch it. No, he that was a dick move! That was just a dick move there. That was mean. Ah! Okay, so it's basically the same fight, just over and over, just keep doing that, and keep doing what I told you. If I had a little bit more health, I would've made it, but there's probably a better way to do that, I just don't know of it, because I still... Glass. Sorry. I still am not very good. I'm good at the game, I'm just not as good as some other people, maybe. Stop it. Okay, so, I keep using mic, sorry. Um, something you should do, that is actually a good idea that I, that I decided to do just now, is that, um, when you're jumping to avoid the attack, shoot a bullet. That will work perfectly, actually. And, sit right here, you got him! Okay, well, I got him. You being part of me, and embodiment of myself, and do a little jump to keep us in place, be a little ballerina dancer, and... 100,000 points! Gammy gammy. And 10,000 more points. That's that's really good, actually. Okay, let's continue. On to... Um, I'm gonna go with... Electric Man. Because he has a... I think
think he has one or two hidden items. I don't remember what, how many, but he has a few hidden items. Oh, whoa. This one part of platforming is always what bothered me. How close do you have to get to the edge to jump? Whoa, come on. Okay, and we have that that's probably my hardest part. The rest of it's pretty simple. Just a bunch of little electric puzzles on occasion. That's about it. I name puzzles just electric evasion. Um, you should let yourself get hit by at least one of these guys. That way you can get to the other. And it'll be pretty simple overall. I, I'm going to go grab that health down there. So I'll just go down the slider and you can grab this health here. Let's be a little more careful. Actually, okay, we'll just hurt yourself at the beginning and then jump up and then... I guess I got more in the long run, so whatever. Just you want to make time to jump perfectly, because they'll just shoot one after another, so the electric stuff. They'll just shoot one after another. It's pretty simple to avoid. Just do what I told you, and you should be fine. Okay, this part, there are two. There are guys coming from the top and bottom. The top guys are the only real concern to you. Just keep going up and shoot them right when they're about to shoot you. This part has a block, so let's see if I can kind this right. Oh, I did. Nice. Oh, no, you need to go that way. Dang it. Okay, good. Now, over the left, there's um, things that will charge your other powers later on, but since we don't have any other really important powers yet, we don't care. Powers ain't items, I should say. Not just powers. I don't know. Decided so to shoot that for no reason. And we continue onwards. And over there, we see a health. Don't go for it. Just a little tease. It'll be mean to you and make you sad. I guess. I don't know. And up! Oh, okay, good. That's a pretty simple platform. You just have to be a little quick about it, and you should be fine. I think the safer route to go here is to go right. Um, that's my personal opinion. Um, there's those guys. Over there. Okay, be careful around this guy. Okay. Oh wow. Actually, oh, I almost made it without getting hurt. Shame. Okay, so there's more of these guys around here to shoot a little earlier. Fudge. Oh come on. Oh, you didn't even drop any health. Ah, I don't care about the bonus point right now. Just gotta be a little more careful. Okay, see that power up over there? Okay, so, in the game, there are different blocks like these that just stick out from the rest. You may saw in an earlier one when I pointed out with Gutsman Battle, you can pick them up with the Gutsman ability and just throw them. And with that, you get this ability. This is the, I think it's like Mega Platform, I don't remember exactly what it's called, but it lets you shoot up platforms. I will demonstrate that later, so I don't waste it now. Okay, okay. This part's pretty simple, you just have to stop and wait. Okay, this next part involves more soft points than I thought it was that part. Okay, the very next part has a... Uh, that was a... Oh, come on, I jumped too high. <laughs> okay. So at this point, there is this little guy who will jump down. You want to lure him over to the left, because if you don't, he will jump down on the ladder and make you sad. Uh, you want to grab this. And... Okay. <laughs> So let's use um, this power here. If you don't get this power along the way, um, you can't kill up this part, so you have to go all the way back around, which is very upsetting, but eh, whatever works. This, is, this part here, you just replay the previous platform and just jump, jump, jump. Oh! Fadoodle. I messed that up, so I guess I have to redo the stage. Dang it! I don't want to redo the stage. Man. That's one part I have this. I can never go without using it continues. I always have to use it continues. Oh, oh, come on, stop lagging. Stop lagging. There we go. Okay. Now, now we continue. Okay. Just, uh, take after this guy. Doesn't matter. Ah! Uh, oh. If stay on the platform, it'll be a little bit better, but I don't care. So, just continue. So, if I die, I don't get a checkpoint, which is just kind of sad, but whatever. Makes, me, makes my head sad. It's upsetting. Murder, murder, murder. Oh, I missed! No! Oh, man! Ah, I never do that! I keep messing up one part up. Uh, starting to mess up these guys. Never messed up on these guys before my practice runs. Stupid. Murder, murder, murder. Okay. Now we have 3,200 points. Looks selfish, but whatever. Ah, oh, I messed up timing. I can never get that timing right when I do that one. Oh, f oh, come on! No, don't fall the way down. Ah, it's the third time to do this. 
Screw you. Screw you. Screw you. I'm actually gonna go. That, that health. 